What's going on YouTube? Late Shadow Thorn here, back again here with a video. This is actually going to be a Pokemon tag video. If you don't know what a tag video was, just like me, like two days ago, what it is is a people, something that's been around in the community for a while now. Uh, someone that you know tags you, pretty much calls you out, and they you have to answer a series of questions that they have answered themselves. So I was actually tagged by the Dark Gengar, his channel will be down in the description below of this video, and don't mind my dogs, they like to run around rampant. So anyways, there's a Wi-Fi battle playing for your enjoyment, just, you know, you can pay attention to it, but also pay attention to my voice. First question is, um, what are you called and why are you called your name? Uh, I'm named Blade Shadow Thorn. Funny story, actually, when I was younger, I used to play a game called Wizard 101. Not sure if any of you heard of it, know of it, but anyways, when you make your character, they make crazy names because I guess that's sort of the appeal of it. You make, like, a pretty crazy name. Actually, I clicked random name generator. That was the name that came up. So that's just the name that I've stuck with for, uh... Well, I'm tied now, because I didn't play that game when I was like 10 years old or something like that, but anyways. Uh, next question is sort of like two questions combined into one. Uh, it says, how old are you and what is your first memories of Pokemon? I am currently 17 years old, and uh, my first memory of Pokemon was actually my friend telling me to play this game. And I was like, what game is this that you are referring me to? And it turned out to be Pokemon, and I turned out to like it, and it turned out to actually stay with it for quite a long time. And the uh, next question is something that's always been a little bit of embarrassment to me. It says, what is your first Pokemon game? My first Pokemon game is Pokemon Platinum. So I came really late into the Pokemon community. Most people started, you know, people say like, oh, my first game was Ruby, or my first game was Blue, and stuff like that. I'm like, I started in Platinum, which... And it wasn't like just when uh, Platinum came out, too. It was like long after it's been out for like months then. Because uh, actually, Alpha, uh, the next one was like Tarkoal or Soul Silver that came out that Easter. So uh, it wasn't too far away. So uh, my first game was Platinum, and uh, suffice it to say, Sinnoh has always been my favorite region. It's not one of the questions, but still just something there. Um, the next question is why have you. Uh, what does Pokemon. Actually, no, I missed what, what does this Pokemon mean to you? Pokemon means to me, like, it's just a way to connect with other people over a similar goal or interest that we all share. Because it's sort of like connecting, because that's pretty much how it is in the community, is people just build off each other and stuff like that. So, you know, teamwork and stuff, and you have to, a bit of strategy as well, because I, I personally really like strategy games. It's uh, some of the things, I really like chess, that sort of thing, so uh, having to build a team that synergizes well with each other, that plays off each other, that deals with threats, and don't mind that, that was the, just the door. But anyways, that's pretty much what Pokemon really means to me. Um, the next question is question five, and it says, why have you made this channel? I made this channel originally for my voice acting career because I like doing voice acting. Don't really voice act that much anymore because I've sort of branched off to that to the entertainment field. And don't mind my dog, she barks quite a lot. Jazzy, I'm recording. See, and you, if, you, if you point at her and you say, Jazzy, I'm recording, she kind of mimics it a little bit. But anyways, um, going right into that, uh, made this channel pretty much just because I like voice acting and then I also wanted to be an entertainer. Yeah. Uh, that sort of branched off into Pokemon because uh, I remember I watched Puddles A1 actually he was one of the first people that actually inspired me to do uh, Pokemon narrated Wi-Fi battles and stuff like that I really liked watching his content that mystical John Origins all that fun stuff I actually never even heard of the, like the bigger Pokemon names which is funny enough until after I got well into the community a bit and then the, the last uh, question is uh, what can you expect obviously you can expect uh, from what you were seeing in front of your eyes while with Pokemon Wi-Fi battles I do a lot of those because I have a fancy capture card thingy Mobobber and um, yeah that's uh, that's that so I, I do that um, I also do showdown live stuff like that of that nature sometimes I do Lego animation videos which is what I did originally uh, if you looked at the very like years ago I put up like a couple that I did when I was younger and then I recently put one up like four months ago that I had to do for a project so you know that's there uh, sometimes when I throw up some videos that I've done for school because I am part of the video video which is kind of another reason why I created this channel I just like making videos it's a hobby of mine, so um, yeah, it's just like Pokemon narrated Wi-Fi Battle, Showdown Live, the third of the new series, Sweeper Swept, which is pretty much either getting sweep, sweeping or swept because uh, I don't have much time to record as much as I did because I am actually full old in college, so uh, I have college classes, I have uh, high school, and then I'm also vice president for uh, the Digital Media Club in my college as well as uh, a member of the uh, writing club, so uh, I got my hands. You know, I still enjoy uh, narrating Wi-Fi battles. I still like enjoy uh, videos. So 
so that will not stop me. The uploads, to normally I like to upload once a week. <laughs> no, not once a week, once a day. But uh, lately I've been missing a couple days, but uh, hopefully you'll get at least three, uh, three videos of some sort from me, uh, whether they're narrating my battles, whether they're just uh, funny clips or showdown battles, whatever is the case. But um, I think I'm done talking, so now apparently what we have to do is we have to tag other people. So uh, their channels will be down in the description below as well. So first person I'm going to be tagging is a little guy called Kashba. He makes cool videos. He's one of actually the first people I met on uh, for creating in the Pope. When I first started PokeTubing, he was one of the first people I met. Him, uh, OU Lander, Speaking Frostlesk, uh, Crimson Sparrow, the crew, the peoples. Uh, next person I'm going to be tagging is uh, B2J135. Again, channel will be down in the description below. Uh, he was actually the first person that introduced me to um, the Skype group that I'm in right now. He was actually the original creator of that. I was added by. Uh, was a sea slug, I think. He had me to that, so uh, I've been part of that for uh, quite a long time. And then the last person I'm going to tag is um, the Sorkinist, actually, because um, I really want him to answer these questions and suffer as I have suffered doing this. So that is um, that is just me done talking right now. There is still six turns left in this battle, so I will just shut up, let you watch it, and um, now you know a little bit more about me. Dun dun dun. So anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time. For the record, I choke here tremendously. Um, I should have went for the Aqua Jet. If I went for the Aqua Jet, I would have won the battle, but because Trick Room was still up, I really expected him to switch there. Uh, just a fun fact I thought you should know, because uh, I know I haven't said anything shut up, but that actually cost me the match right there. Uh, if I would have went for the Aqua Jet, I would have been able to win the battle because all I had left was his Chimeco. And the PU Scizor, which is Scarfed actually, would have been able to uh, clean up from there. But anyways, he crits, eruptions me, so way overkill but anyways that is the wi-fi battle rate comment sub um i know i said i would shut up and i did but uh for a little bit for a little bit but uh you can never shut up me so uh, thanks for watching i'll see you all next time bye